Welcome to Easy BTEC, your guide for BTEC and beyond. In the today's lecture, we will discuss about bias compensation using diode. How uh, stability can be obtained using diode? How the diode uh, BJT stabilization can be occurred using this uh, diode? And how uh, operating point will remain stable? how the system remains stable that we will see today. Okay, students. Bias compensation. Bias compensation. Okay. Which makes which makes the output current which makes the output current constant the operating point the operating point remains stable operating point stable okay these are the bias compensation this bias compensation can be made using three cases one is we use a bias compensation, bias compensation using diodes, using diode, second, using thermistors, thermistor. These two concepts we will see today. Okay, bias compensation using diodes. Bias compensation using diode. Okay, we are using PN junction diode. PN junction diode is connected across VBE across VBE now if you see the structure you can understand This is connected to VCC. Are taking here the capacitor. Output is taken across here. This is V out. Here we are connecting a diode. This is a diode. The voltage here to here, this is VBE diode. We're applying input across here. This resistance RB, this resistance RC. This is a circuit diode compensation. Diode compensation. Okay, here. First thing you can remember, diode is connected in reverse bias, in reverse bias, because current through the diode increases, okay, in minority only increases, that is effect of temperature we have clearly studied, effect of temperature, in effect of temperature, on the slide we clearly studied that is temperature increases I, I not reverse saturation current increases by that is if it is a 10 degree rise it will be double if it is a 1 degree rise it will be 7 percent increase 7 percentage of I not okay 
Now the diode is connected in reverse bias circuit. It is a negative and positive. And now you can see here. Here the current is I. The from here the current division takes place. Here the current is I B current. And uh, this side current is I not current. Okay. The total current equation you can write I is equal to I B. Plus I not current division takes place. I is equal to I B. From this equations we can write a I B is equal to I minus I not. The students, you may write this I B is equal to I minus I not. I B is the base current. I is the current through R B. I not is the reverse saturation current. Reverse reverse saturation current. Okay, now from this diagram you can clearly understand this is the current division can be takes place here. That is the concept. You can see as temperature increases, as temperature increases, what happens? Reverse saturation current increases. Reverse saturation current I not increases. Okay, as temperature increases, this uh, transistor. Transistor reverse saturation current I C not also increases. It means due to increasing in temperature, I not increase, I C not also increase. And one thing you have to remember: both, both diode and transistor are made up of are made up of same material. Same material, either silicon or germanium. Either it is a silicon or germanium. Now you can see here. Here it is a transistor. This is BC one zero seven. It is a diode. IN four zero zero. It means the diode is made up of silicon, and here this transistor is made up of silicon. Both should be same material. Then the current uh, uh, can be take current uh, flows through the material can be similar. Now here it, it is very clear. As the temperature increases, reverse saturation current will increase. It means as the temperature increases, maximum current can be uh, goes through the I not. Maximum current can be goes through the I not. Very clear, students. You can understand here as. Temperature increases, maximum reverse saturation current through the diode can increases. It means the total current, total current. You can see total current I is equal to I is equal to I not I not plus I B. It means the current through the diode and the uh, transistor. That is, if the temperature increases, I not increases. Now definitely. If I not increases, I B decreases. Okay. As temperature increases, I not increases. As I not increases, you can see I B is equal to I minus I not. As I not increases, I B what happens? I B decreases. I B decreases. As I B decreases, what happens? I C is equal to beta into I B because both are directly proportional. Now, as as I B decreases, I C also decreases. Like that, the the current the current through the through the transistor transistor can be reduced. Reduce through through a 
रिवर्स बायस रिवर्स बायस डायोड रिवर्स बायस डायोड इज कनेक्टेड एक्रॉस बेस एमिटर जंक्शन एक्रॉस बेस एमिटर जंक्शन एक्रॉस बेस एमिटर जंक्शन बाय कनेक्टिंग ए डायोड इन रिवर्स बायस ए लार्जर ए लार्ज रिवर्स सैचुरेशन करंट करंट फ्लोस थ्रू डायोड थ्रू डायोड थ्रू द डायोड एंड IB current is reduced. IB current is reduced. Same the concept because as the temperature increases, I not increases. I I not increases means IB decreases. As IB decreases, IC will decreases. Like that, uh, the collector current, the collector current remains stable. the collector current remains stable using using uh, a diode is placed using a diode is placed okay next uh, this we will call as uh, by uh, diode compensation technique is it clear next i can say here using thermistor using thermistor in the using thermistor also same this is biasing resistance r1 and r2 it is a transistor r e c okay students now this this is known as a thermistor okay thermistor is a thermistor is a negative temperature coefficient negative temperature coefficient okay negative temperature coefficient now what you can say as as temperature increases reverse saturation current increases and the voltage across vbe decreases and the voltage across vbe decreases now you can see as temperature increases reverse saturation current increases reverse saturation current increases but vbe decreases we know due to the temperature cutting voltage vbe decreases vbe decreases as vbe decreases ib decreases as ib decreases ic decreases okay the collector current the collector current made stable okay the operating point is the operating point is fixed distortion free output distortion free output okay students you can clearly understand here from the diagram this is a uh, temperature the thermistor thermistor is nothing but thermal resistor as temperature okay this thermistor is nothing but it is a, a thermistor is a negative temperature coefficient as temperature increases temperature increases resistance decreases okay as temperature increases resistance decreases and the voltage across vbe decreases 
we know as a temperature from the effect of the temperature as temperature increases ic increases ic increases ic not increases ic not increases ic not increases ic increases but vb decreases vb decreases ib decreases ib decreases ic decreases is it clear like that uh, you can understand clearly by connecting a thermistor across the base to emitter junction or connecting a thermistor parallel to r2 resistor now what happens due to increasing in temperature uh, the voltage across base to emitter will decreases which leads to decreasing the ib which leads to decreasing i the ic that is a uh, stable which maintains a stable output stable output collector current stable output collector current that is why this bias compensation circuit is used okay, students you can see here clearly what you can uh, keep here thermistor compensation circuit thermistor compensation circuit the thermistor is a thermistor is connected connected parallel to parallel to resistor r2 resistor r2 okay where thermistor is a thermistor is a negative temperature coefficient negative temperature coefficient that is as temperature increases resistance decreases resistance decreases okay due to temperature due to temperature due to temperature increase resistor of thermistor is exponentially decrease is exponentially decreases okay exponentially decreases due to which due to which vb decreases ib decreases because for an input characteristics we can plot graph this is the graph this is ib this is vb the cutting voltage will decreases that is for every 1 degree rise in temperature the cutting voltage will decreases by minus 2.5 millivolts okay like that vb decreases ib decreases ib decreases ic decreases okay output current remains stable remains stable okay students this is about a this is about a, a thermistor okay is a btec guide for btec and bn thank you